Hey guys, Malcolm here, Survival Know How. Today I'm be talking about a new monthly subscription box program that's geared towards survivalists and preppers. It's called Prepper Gear Box, and I have in front of me their initial box that they send out to all new subscribers. So I'll be opening it up and giving you my thoughts on it. Stay tuned. So the first thing that I noticed when I got this box is actually the box itself, right? It is just a, a plain, ordinary box that you might get from Amazon. Um, and I actually like that. You know, too often products like this, they spend all their money on the boxes to make them uh, pop and catchy, and they don't spend the money on the actual merchandise inside. You know, um, there's another company out there that does boxes for survivalists and they actually have ammo cans and every month they send you a brand new ammo can full of all your gear. Uh, and what people don't realize is that you're buying that ammo can, you're paying for that. That is where your money is going towards. So uh, I, I like that it's just a plain ordinary box. That means that my money is not going towards a presentation, it's actually going towards the gear itself. So let's open it up. Uh, so first off, when you open it up, you get a little post card from Prepper Gearbox just saying thank you for uh, subscribing, kind of explaining what to expect in future boxes. Pretty much says that you should get one to three items per month in your Prepper Gearbox. So next up is uh, this paper here. It kind of breaks down all the items that you're actually getting in your box this month, as well as the retail value of those items. And then it looks like you can actually enter a little drawing to win some more so, uh, prepper gear. All right, so onto the pretty much the first item is uh, these little informational cards. I like this. Knowledge is power. Uh, you know, being a prepper is not just about having the right gear; it's about having the right knowledge. So, thumbs up to Prepper Gearbox for this. Uh, this here is self-defense pressure points. Kind of outlines uh, different points that you want to go to, go for. Here is just uh, some information on how to make a solar still. You know, it's the kind of thing you might see in the SAS survival guide. So, uh, cool, I like that. Um, it'd be awesome if they did this for every month. They give you some more cards to kind of add to your knowledge. So, thumbs up, thumbs up for that. All right, so next up, let's just jump right in and go straight for the knife. So they've included a Mora knife in this box. Now, if you're not familiar with Mora, um, they are affordable knives, okay? But uh, they have a reputation for being very high quality, very durable, and also being very affordable. Um, a lot of people recommend uh, getting, if you're just getting the bushcraft, to get a, a Mora knife just because they are very affordable and you get uh, a very high bang for your buck when you buy one of these. Um, I like Mora knives. I always like the uh, rubber grips that they have. They're very comfortable, very sturdy knives. Oh, I actually own a Mora knife. I have the Mora Black, which is their survival edition. Um, and as you can see, it comes with a ferrocesium rod. It comes with a, uh, a sharpening stone here, and that's, that's kind of what makes it their survival edition. But the blades themselves are pretty similar. So this is the black which I own, and this is the Mora knife that came in the box. They're definitely very similar. You can easily identify Mora knives. Um, they both have these rubber grips, very comfortable. This one is uh, a good bit lighter than the Mora knife that I have. But I am, I'm pretty happy with the, this. I like Mora knives. So props to uh, Prepper Gearbox for the Mora knife. So next up in the box you get um, it's a little keychain lighter, okay? But this is really like two items in one because you also get this waterproof container here. So these waterproof containers are nice. I have a, a very similar one that has a first aid kit in it. Just keep in mind these are just kind of cheap plastic. I have had these before where this little latch on the side actually breaks off. But these are nice just to keep uh, items dry, you know, if you're going out in the water or if you want to throw something in your bag. But inside we have a little keychain lighter. Uh, it looks very sleek. I like it. I like how it looks. You open it up and, and see it's just it's like a little zippo lighter, okay? You're gonna have to take it out and you're gonna have to get some lighter fluid and kind of soak the bottom, you know, just like you would a zippo. 
but this makes a great addition to your EDC, right? You throw this on your keychain, you don't have to worry about it um, when you're actually in a bad situation and you've got your little, your little lighter right here. Uh, but like I said, you have to go out and buy some lighter fluid. It's just like three bucks to fill this up. Or if you have Zippo light, lighters, you already have some lighter fluid at home. So this is the second item in uh, the Prepper gear box. So I like it guys, thumbs up. And the last item in the Prepper gear box is one of these tactical pens. All right, so this is a, an aluminum pen. It actually is a pen. And on the back here, it has uh, one of these glass shattering punches. Supposedly, you can also use this thing as self-defense. You know, it seems very sturdy, so I definitely believe it. And this kind of goes along with the pressure point cards that they uh, included. You know, I sure as heck wouldn't want somebody jabbing me in the eye or the throat with this. Now, this is a, kind of a basic tactical pen. Um, I have another tactical pen here that just literally has more bells and whistles to it. Like literally has a whistle on the end here. Uh, this pen that I have has a terracesium rod for uh, starting fires. So the pen that I have is made by Schrade and it's just a little bit more expensive, a little bit higher quality. I guess it has more features to it. Uh, the pen that they've included is really just a pen a punch, and then it just looks cool. All right, so that is the last item in the initial prepper gear box. Just to recap, uh, you get a Mora knife, very nice. You get a little waterproof container here, cool. You get some cards with some knowledge on it, awesome. You get a uh, little keychain Zippo, nice. And you get a tactical pen, very cool. If you guys are interested in any of the gear that you've seen in the video today, I'll have links to all of these items in the description below. So my final thoughts on Prepper Gear Box is that this is a very affordable box, okay? Um, there are other boxes in this niche. Uh, like I said, there's one that ships out in an ammo container like that, and they can quite literally be over $100 a month to get that gear. Uh, this is $25 a month plus $5 shipping. And you get some good gear in here, right? I like it. So if you're like me and you like going out and buying new survival gear all the time, you like playing with new toys like this, you know, or if you're just kind of a new prepper and you're slowly building up your, your inventory survival gear, you know, I would recommend this box to you. So I reached out to Prepper Gearbox and they're gonna hook my viewers up with a 10% discount. So if you guys are interested in trying out this box, go to preppergearbox.com and under the promotional code section, enter survival know-how and no spaces in it. If you guys are new to my channel, hit that big red subscribe button down below. I upload a lot of videos about survival and prepping. Until next time, guys, stay safe.